What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. Here is some exciting information for all those Android phone users out there. Microsoft has released a feature which enables us to access the Android phone's storage right there on the file explorer on your PC. Sounds pretty interesting, isn't it? Let me just show you that. You see, this is the Galaxy S24 Ultra that I've got here and I have connected this device with this PC here. Let me just open the file explorer here on the PC. You can see on the left hand side, we have got S24 Ultra. I can just tap on this to access the device right here. We have got one folder here called storage. When I double tap on that, you can see all the folders on my device are available right here. I can open any of the folders here and in a jiffy it opens up and I can access any of the pictures or images. Let me just uh, open this particular folder. You can see it quickly opens up and I will be able to uh, see all of these images. Let me open one of these images here. It downloads the file onto the PC and it opens up right here. Let's go to the next image. This is pretty cool. Now let me just open up another uh, folder here. Let's open up a video. Let me go to DCIM. I'll open camera. It takes a few seconds to open these images or videos for the first time, but once it is opened, you will be able to quickly access it the next time you try to open that. Now let's open this particular video file here. I'll double click. I'll select the media player. You see it is downloading this item from the phone and it will play that video on the PC here. You see the video has started playing here. Let me just close this. So basically we have got all the files and folders available on your Android phone are available or are accessible on your PC, which is amazing. And we do not need to connect a USB cable or we don't even need a third party application or link to Windows feature to be accessed for accessing all these folders. Now let me tell you how exactly this works. Now there are some prerequisites for this feature to work. Microsoft has just started releasing this feature for the Windows PCs. Uh, your Windows PC should be running on either Windows 10 or Windows 11, the latest versions. And you need to update the cross device experience host on your PC. Now this update may or may not be available for your PC, but it looks like Microsoft has already started rolling this feature out globally. The update might happen automatically. And once you connect your phone to your PC, you may be able to see your device storage right here on the file explorer on your PC. Now let me break down the steps to enable this feature. First, you need to make sure you have got a link to Windows application installed on your Android phone. On Samsung Galaxy phones, by default, we get this feature. Uh, let me just go to the settings here, tap on connected devices. This is where you will see link to Windows. I have already enabled it and I have also connected this using the same Microsoft account on this PC. So you need to connect both the devices using the same Microsoft ID through link to Windows application. Now on the PC, we've got an application called phone link. Let me show you that. Let me just go to the app tray here. I'll search for phone link. You see, this is the application. Let me tap on that. This is where we get to access all our files if you have connected the phone using the link to Windows application on the Android device. First, make sure to connect your phone using this application. This window will prompt you to connect your device, connect your phone to the PC using phone link application. Once that is connected, all you need to do is just go to the settings on your PC. Here you will see Bluetooth and devices. Just tap on that. And here you will see mobile devices tap on that and on the top right you will see manage devices once you tap on that you will see the devices that you already connected just make sure these are enabled and if you have not added the device yet just tap on add new device and you can scan the QR code to link your Android mobile device. So if you're directly connecting your device using this, I don't think you need link to Windows uh, or phone link application. I'm not sure about that, but this is where you can connect your device. Once you're connected, you may be able to see uh, the device right here on the file explorer. If you're still not seeing it, just go to the Microsoft uh, store and here just go to downloads. And this is where you will see this option cross device experience host. Make sure you have updated cross device experience host. Once that is done, you should be able to see your device right here on the file explorer, which is incredible. Now it's very easy to access all your files and folders directly on your PC, right there on the file explorer, you'll be able to copy and paste the files, we'll be able to download the files, and we'll also be able to edit them 
right there on the device wirelessly connected. I think this is working on the Wi-Fi. So it may be using the Wi-Fi direct feature to access all the files from your device. Doesn't matter. This is a great feature now we have got. Let me know what do you think about this. Drop a comment and while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel and the customization video on this home screen setup is coming up soon. So stay tuned for that video. That's all I wanted to share with you guys in this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you have already subscribed to the channel. If you haven't subscribed already, go ahead, subscribe. You get to learn a lot about your Galaxy phones, Android phones, etc. Make sure to subscribe and give this video a like if you find this video informative. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. Cheers. Bye-bye.